Hey everybody, welcome back to my page, Hot Mess Express Tutorials. If this is your first time here, then welcome! Today we're going to be doing this super, super simple, super, super easy, and quick makeup look today. So you're just your regular back to school, something that you can do in like 10 to 20 minutes in the morning and be out the door. We're going to be using our imagination today and pretending that I'm a senior in college and that I didn't graduate from high school almost 10 years ago. <gasps> I'm not crying, you're crying. But stick around and I'm going to show you all about this look. Three, two, one. Hashtag fresh face. Okay, or somewhat fresh face because even though I used makeup remover and I used face wash last night and this morning. I still seem to have mascara and eyeliner a little bit. Like I don't know if anyone else has that problem. Like it's so super super hard to get mascara off of my face. I don't know why. Anyway, we're gonna start with our hashtag fresh face. When you're getting ready for school, you wanna start by waking up. So what you can do is get a spray bottle of water and just spray your face, just wake wake up. The water is the best way, or if you're a little bit fancy, you can use the Urban Decay B6 Vitamin Infused Complexion Prep Primer Spray. Whatever is in your budget. So I'm gonna try to keep things as cheap as possible, or at least give recommendations for things that you could do instead to make it cheaper, because I know when you're in school, you are on a budget of nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna spray my face with this B6. Let it dry. Next I'm going to go in with the Pixi Flawless Beauty Primer. Pixi products you can get at Target. And I think this is just a sample that I got from Ipsy. But I know that you can get this at Target. And it is so, so important to prime your face. Especially if you're at school all day trying to strut your face. Too old to bend down like that. <laughs> okay, once your face is properly primed, you can move on to your eyeshadow, which is super easy. It's like the easiest makeup you will, it's like beginners can do it. Now you can use this with a finger or, or a brush. I know I said I was gonna be keeping this cheap, but I'm gonna be using the Urban Decay Naked 2 eyeshadow palette. And yes, it says run for $54 but you can use any like nude or like pale off-white I guess color and any brown so I'm gonna go in with boxy I'm literally just talking about how important it is for primer and I did not even prime my eyes so once you get into the hang of putting on your makeup every day you hopefully remember these things um, but I'm gonna be using the Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion Put that all over my eye, dab it in. So you have Foxy, and you're just gonna pat that all over your eye. And like I said, that comes with a brush. If you don't have a brush, you could even just use your finger. There you go. And I wanted to use this palette because I know that the original Naked eyeshadow palette, they're getting rid of it. R.I.P. That's another reason I want to use this Naked 2 palette today. After we put Foxy on our eyes, this is just, you know, like, just as a, I guess, a base, but at the same time, like, this is mostly just it. Like, we're gonna use Tease, which is just a light brown color, and I just put it right on the crease, just on the outside, though. Lastly, I'm going to go in with Booty Call. You don't even have to do this part. Like, this is just because I I like to have a little bit of highlight on my eyebrow bone. Lighten it up. Use your clean brush or your finger. And that is it for the eyeshadow. I know. You're shocked. Super easy. Two shadows, maybe three if you want to go the extra mile. Then all you have to do to add to that is some mascara. Uh, I went through college using Ipsy, and I got so many makeup samples, it like lasted me. Honestly, some of them I still have, which I don't know if that's still good. But like, and now I buy my own makeup, but I still use Ipsy because I get to 
try all these new makeup products. $10 and you can afford $10 a month for that? Like, you get makeup. I don't know. I'm all about the free samples. This is the Tarte Man Eater Mascara. And it's just a little sample one. I'm going to put it on your top eyelash. Not even going to put it on the bottom because it's daytime. It's not a nighttime look. Plus, you're going to have a leftover from last night anyway, right? I guess I'll do my brows. I feel like if you're just going to school, you don't really have to do your brows. But I guess that's now become such a big thing in the beauty community. But I'm just going to literally fill them in. Like, I'm not even going to try to go for the Instagram brow because when I was going to school, brows were not a thing. <laughs> no one had eyebrows. We waxed them off. I'm going to be doing less than that because look, we're going back to drugstore stuff. So this is the Essence Make Me Brow Brow Gel Mascara, and this just puts a little bit of color in your brows. Now we're gonna go back to our face, which we started with, but then I got distracted with eyeshadow, and I'm gonna use a beauty blender that I got from Forever 21. It just says makeup sponge, and I got it for $3.90, so I think that's pretty cheap for a makeup sponge. Well, but yeah, do you see it? It's nice, it's soft, it's squishy. Hey! So I'm going to be using another drugstore product that you can find at your local drugstore. Which is uh, L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow in shade 203, which is Nude Beige. And I'm just going to give myself some, some dots. And you know what's so great is that even though we did put the primer on earlier because the eye look is so quick to do that it's not like it crazy dries before we're able to put the foundation on. Work it in before it dries. I wanted to use the Maybelline Fit Me Full Coverage because you know I'm a full coverage kind of lady but I did not have the funds for that so I went with a drugstore product that I knew I had and I knew that you guys could use. So next we're going to go in with the Benefit Cheek Parade and the reason that I'm using this is because you can use the bronzer as well as the blush. Mm, this smells really good. I forgot. I know that that's also not it's like great. that's not a drugstore product but I think that you get a really good benefit of having <laughs> benefit of having the blush and the bronzer. One day I'll do a full drugstore makeup video. So if you want that, comment down below. We're just going to put a little bit of bronzer on our cheeks because I know that we've just been soaking in the sun. Or we've been at work all summer and we had our one day at the beach and we are tan from just that one day. So we're just going to put just a little bit working that in. Just doing our cheeks. Like normally I do the whole heart. We don't need all that extra stuff for today. You need to put concealer on. You don't need to. But I want to because I don't sleep. So, and I'm sure that you're not sleeping either because you're either out studying or you're out partying or doing a little bit of both. And I will say that even though studying can be a drag, that's where you're gonna get a lot of your memories from. Like if you're studying with friends, that's where the memories come from. As you can see, I just put the tiniest bit, like with the shape tape or probably with most concealers like you don't need a lot like look how much that spread like all these beauty bloggers like put it all over their face and it's not necessary so that is saving you money and saving you product then i'm going to go in with the blush which is called dandelion i'm going to put that all over my cheeks because you are young and full of life and ready for this school year I'm gonna kill it. And then a little bit on the bridge of my nose, because that's the trend now. I'm used to matte foundations, and like we know already, this is Pro Glow, which is a glowing foundation, and so I'm just not used to being so shiny, especially with this light on me. I just feel like, ugh, it's greasy. But that is besides the point. Some people like that, that glowy look, so we're gonna pretend like we like it today. That's it for the face. We're not gonna put highlighter on, and I'm crying a little bit inside. I mean, Obviously you can still put on highlighter, but we're just going for the most simple look that we can. So this is all the makeup that you're going to do probably inside your house. And then you're going to get ready, you're going to get all your, your books and your stuff, you're going to go to your car, and then you're going to have your EOS ready in your little tray 
of things that hold things. What? They're gonna put on your lips, in the car, at the red light, or maybe in your backpack. You can just do that on the bus. And then you're gonna put on your nude lipstick. We're just keeping it so simple, so easy. But I have two NYX lipsticks. I have a NYX liquid suede and a NYX lingerie. Oh well, look at you, NYX. So this one is like kind of pinky too, and this one is like a legit just pale nude. And because I've just been keeping it so simple, I didn't do any highlight. I think I'm gonna do both of these colors. I had to like, I had to spruce this, this look up just a little bit. So you can use just one of these and the look will be perfectly fine. So this is from the Liquid Suede and this is called, this is called Soft Spoken. Soft Spoken. Dab a little bit. And this new color is called Satin Ribbon. And then I'm going to get it all over my teeth. And lastly, to keep this look together all day, you have the NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray. And that can be sprayed before you put your lipstick on as well. Okay, so this is the final look. This is the super easy, super quick, simple, get ready for school makeup look that you can do every day. The more often you do it, the quicker you'll get at it. So maybe you'll start doing it at 20 minutes. And then by the end of the year, you'll have it done in like 10 minutes. Uh, hopefully this helped. Hopefully there were some good tricks in here. Um, also, definitely keeping the ponytail on my head because honestly, do people wear their hair down to school now? Like, bun's always out. If you like this video, you can go give it a like, a thumbs up. Uh, also, subscribe, comment. Do you think that 10-year high school reunions are necessary with Facebook nowadays? And then share this to all of your friends and new friends that you meet who are going to school. You can follow me on Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram. My Hot Mess Express tip of the day is to take every opportunity that you can. Now is your time. If they have pizza day in the quad or if they have like learning yoga in the cafeteria, do it. because. You're gonna get out of college and yoga's gonna be like $90. And you're gonna be like, man, I wish I did it when it was free. Or they have so many resources there that you can use, like the library, they have uh, the movies, health, so many different resources. Take advantage of all that you can because you know you don't know what you're gonna learn, who you're gonna meet, you could meet your best friend for life just through through one activity. And enjoy it. Have a great year guys and I'll see you in my next one.